Okay, get the carpet rolled out. Simple. Cut this off, make it easier. No. Okay, it's laid out, and that's it for now. All right. Okay, old carpets out, new carpets in, it's laid out, ready to go. I'm gonna start stretching it. This is real simple. I'm using a power stretcher here. Power stretcher, I'm not kicking it in. I'm using a power stretcher, get it stretched properly. You got pins. This is a wood floor, so you can put pins there and be pretty simple here. It shouldn't take too long, okay. just a short span so I don't even take a full bite 
Stretch across first, then come this way. Again, you don't want to take a full bite or you'll take too much. When I say that, I mean, see, I kind of pick it up. See how I did that? away from this too. We'll be going that way. This is my set wall. I'm using this wall as my set wall. Then I'll be stretching the opposite direction.
this way with the rest of the car bed. Mm -hmm. And the wall trimmer. setting into the nails, just little strip tacks. Can you hear that? Pressing it into the tack strip, okay. So you want to do, make sure it's set in there, okay. This is a small room, so I don't need to stretch the crap out of it. Just enough to get it tight. When you're trimming, you can use the lines on the carpet to figure out where you're cutting. Look at that. basic um, carpet room, basic room to carpet, no seams, just get it cut, and then trim. So that was good. Install carpet and um, using a power stretcher, not a knee kick or a power stretcher. Get it stretched properly. Okay.